Dear friends, welcome to Learning About. In this video, I have come up with a great news. So TCS, they have announced their TCS Atlas hiring for the 2024 batch. In this video, I will be sharing the eligibility criteria, the test uh, procedure and also like how to apply. Okay. And, and also the important dates. Okay. So first regarding the important dates, the registration has already started some time back. Okay. And uh, so the last day to register is Wednesday, 22nd of May, 2024. So you just have hardly three days left. Okay. So those who want, those who have not already registered, please do register immediately because the register, I mean, uh, the center, uh, in, uh, the exam will be in an in center mode and the, your center will be allotted on a first come first serve basis. Okay. So please uh, do apply immediately and the date of exam is uh, 17th of june 2024 monday 17th of june 2024 is the date uh, of exam okay now so let's see who are eligible to apply for this so this is for the 2024 passed out uh msc and you know like ma graduates so in msc three disciplines they are hiring three uh, branches mathematics statistics and economics and in MA, they are hiring economics uh, uh, students. Okay, so uh, these uh, uh, only these graduates or, or post graduates are eligible, and you are expected to have 60 percentage uh, of uh, 60 percentage minimum of 60 percentage score in 10th, 12th uh, diploma if applicable, and graduation and post graduation, and uh, so there should not be any uh, current uh, uh, arrears and gap in education. Only maximum of two years is permitted and uh, only full time courses are permitted okay so the only exception is uh, in schooling if you are uh, from uh, the nios okay they are eligible to apply otherwise everything should be like uh, uh, full time only and work experience uh, this job does not require any work experience but if at all if you have any exper uh, experience up to a maximum of 2 years is permitted okay and the age maximum cut off uh, age limit is uh, 28 years so this is regarding the eligibility now when it comes to the uh, hiring categories okay so there are uh, two offers here one is the atlas offer for uh, 5.3 lakhs per annum ctc and uh, the atlas plus offer for 8 lakhs per uh, uh, annum okay so so this time around uh, they have revealed the uh, offer okay now as far as uh, the test pattern is concerned uh, so the test will be conducted for a duration of 90 minutes and you'll have four sections statistics mathematics economics and you know like uh, programming uh, based on statistical data analysis so uh, all this will be based on you know like your uh, graduation post graduation you know like uh, so uh, qu from that background you can expect the uh, questions okay and they have also uh, mentioned about uh, what role you know like they're uh, offering okay uh, right and uh, so they've also mentioned that uh, knowledge of data science packages such as python or etc will be vital to your uh, role okay and you'll be working on working uh, i mean sorry uh, you will learn and work on different method uh, types of modules understanding and executing best practices and you'll be an expert in communications and uh, presentation required for data scientists etc okay so looks like a, a very interesting and a, a highly you know like uh, no, no, it's a no, like it's a very uh, a good uh, role. Okay, right. So now regarding uh, the uh, wrist. So the link to apply I have provided in the description uh, uh, below. Uh, after watching the video, you can click on the link to apply. And uh, so here for this particular hiring, you have to apply uh, in under the IT category okay if you already have a profile in IT category then you can complete the application and then uh, click on apply for drive otherwise you have to register uh, in the IT category now in case uh, by mistake you create a profile in BPS category you have to mail to TCS delete that uh, profile and you have to definitely register only in IT only then apply for drive will be visible okay so you have to register in IT category so first you have to do the basic uh, portal registration and then you have to complete the application form and then you have to uh, apply for this particular drive and the next step portal uh, basic portal registration they'll ask for your name Aadhaar, Aadhaar is mandatory okay and they'll ask for your date of birth, uh, gender, email, mobile, uh, your institution uh, uh, of last studied okay 
and qualification your year of passing and then uh, you have to give the password as well okay now once you complete the basic registration uh, you will get a mail and uh, so you have to click on that in order to verify that mail and then uh, you, you can use your email id as your username or uh, they'll provide a, a id you can use that and then the password that you have set and then you have to complete the application wherein they'll ask for your personal details your academic details your languages known achievement etc and then finally form preview and uh, declaration okay and in the personal details they'll ask for your address contact details in academic details they'll ask for your 10th 12th graduation post graduation whatever you know like relevant details and then your nationality what are the languages that you are uh, i mean uh, that you have learned that you know and then your achievements certifications etc and then you have to upload your latest photograph and then uh, your uh, cv in the prescribed uh, uh, format okay right now you have to choose you know like mode of test as in center and as i said in the beginning you have to choose it you know like uh, uh, very quickly and uh, carefully right and uh, and then uh, once you have completed the application uh, when you uh, click on track your application uh, uh, i mean uh, once you complete the application uh, it will show apply for drive you have to click on uh, that apply for drive okay i'll show you where it is uh, you, you have to click on the apply for drive and then finally after your submission is over when you click on track your application the status should reflect as applied for drive only that means i mean only in that case it means that you have uh, your application has reached tcs okay right so usually like when you are when you have completed your application and if you are eligible on the left side top okay somewhere around here you will get this apply for drive okay so if you are if only if you are eligible right so just click on this apply for drive and then uh, after that when you track the status the status should reflect as applied for drive only that means that your application has reached uh, tcs okay right so with this uh, i come to the end of this uh, uh, video i hope the information that i have provided here was useful to you if you have any queries please do post your questions in the comment section below and if you like this video please click on the like button and share it with your friends who may need it and if you are not already subscribed to our channel please do subscribe thanks for watching the video have a great day